Welcome back. We're here with Brian from Vets to Success. And what are we making today? We are about to get our zoodle on. Our zoodle on. <laughs> our I can zoodle get my zoodle, zoodle on. on. Yeah. I've never had a zoodle on. <laughs> so if you've never zoodled before, it's uh, there's this whole craze. You know, everybody loves carbs, but the carbs don't necessarily love you. Mm -hmm. And living on the Sun Coast, I always ask for, do you have anything without carbs? So this is that dish that's going to give you that uh, cake and eat it too. Mm -hmm. And it's something super simple. Um, it's a very, it's a little machine, and this is probably the best Christmas gift I got as a chef, because I didn't know I could play with this and just have fun. It's very entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> now, we're going to get over here, we're going to start zoodling. Now, zoodling is a, it's like a noodle, but it's made from, guess what, vegetables. Oh, zucchini. And now, you can pick these up in Publix, and they're already sliced, and there's a little prepackaged piece here for, because yeah. you get time, you know, everybody's about time, and this mm -hmm. is a little summer squash and mm -hmm. zucchini, and so this is yellow, and it's green, so it's fun. A little right. shorter strands, but I love to zoodle in bigger strands because it's got a, just a beautiful pasta-like oh look wow. to it. It does. And, and it's just amazing. Um, and to me, that you know, gives a dish volume, it gives a dish some love, yep. and it makes it more of an experience. And I, I like I, this, too, because I love shrimp scampi, but I don't, I don't usually order it because I'm trying to make a healthier decision, so this will mm -hmm. This will take this away will that. Exactly. So this is kind of have your cake and eat it, too. All right, so you've got Linda on the zoodler. On the yeah, zoodle we're going to start you starting out. It's very simple. We're going to take a regular piece of zucchini, and we're going to go right through the center. And you're gonna push in here, press, and then we're gonna pull our zoodle piece here, and then you're just gonna turn. Oh, this, little, yeah, you sit little, home and do this every night. Yeah, I do. Uh, this is like a like a, one of my hobbies now. Okay. And so you're gonna get <laughs> into right. that, and we're gonna get started over here now. This side of the house is going to be a lot more action station. Now, what? I, I've added a couple <laughs> pieces into here, and this is uh, some shallot, um, which I love shallot. And being a French background, shallot love goes it. in everything. Mm. I can't help it. Um, now, we're going to brenoise the shallot. Have you ever brenoise the shallot? What am I going to do to it? Brenoise. Yes, we can so brenoise. brenoise. I can so brenoise. 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 brenoise makes it very small. So we're going to make it very small. Now, she's got a beautiful sharp knife there, and we're going to make sure that she gets in there. Now, I'm going to start this dish off. Um, now, this dish starts off pretty quickly. Now, I'm using avocado oil because I'm a fan of avocado oil. Okay. Excuse me. Yes, ma'am. I'm not zoodling anymore. Oh, you keep zoodling. <laughs> what, what are we doing? What? So we got to give a little pressure here. We're going to come back in here. We're going to... Oh, got it. Boom. Got there it. Go. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Little, little, right bring him back little muscles the included. Little so muscle <laughs> included here. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, Chef Brian, why avocado oil? You know, I actually, from a healthy standpoint, um, it's got a lot of great of uh, the mono and polysaturated fats. Not as much fatty fats. And so it's a great um, substitute. And someone who likes to stay in shape and eat this, you can eat this raw and plain onto a salad. Very versatile oil versus having okay. a vegetable oil or Crisco, something of that nature. All right, great. Let's get started. So I'm going to go right in. Now, this smoke point is going to be very high. Ready? Because I, not yet, not yet. You're not yet. We're going to get a shrimp first. Okay. So we're going to saute. Now, saute, what does saute mean? What does saute mean? Oh, what does saute oh, mean? Yeah. We're going to just. Um, Fry it up here a little bit. Yeah, it's really Get quick. It. Really quick. Really quick. This dish takes five minutes. Yeah. Especially with shrimp. Yeah. She's done a little bit of garlic. How are you zoodling over there? I, good? I, well, I think she's good. I, I, think I, she's I did get the steamer <laughs> in with the zoodles. Throw me some shallot in there. In there. Oh, that's there you love. Go, baby. That's love. Now I'll give it a nice little stir. Now this is the great part. See, sugar, garlic has a lot of sugar in it, and that's why it turns brown on you. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so you have to have an acid. Real quick. Yeah, to get that love back Where's into Where's the wine? It. Where's the wine? Always got the wine. Ah, that's I, the trick? <laughs> yeah, this is the trick. This or some kind of lemon juice, tomatoes. Um, we're going to do a little bit of both. We're going to let this become a little pink and vibrant. Mm -hmm. Now for this dish, I used a 1620, which is a peeled in the vein shrimp. That's what it means. 1620 means there's about 16 to 20 in a pound. Okay. So you can go to your local seafood, like any 1620s, just sound really knowledgeable. Yeah. They're like, I got you, no worries. Those are the good ones? Those are good ones. Now we're okay. gonna hit this with a little smoked paprika, because mm -hmm. I love a little smokiness oh, yeah. in this. You can't go wrong there. A little red pepper flake, can't go wrong. Now I like a little heat in mine. Obviously not everybody is in my kind of palate. And Himalayan pink salt. Oh, yes. Now, a lot of people are jumping on this craze, and this is great because this is wonderful. All right, Don't Chef, get we are coming up on our last minute here, Ooh. but I love the info we're getting. I'm learning more, I'm yeah. learning more mm -hmm. about how to cook shrimp today than I feel like I've learned in my lifetime. Me too. Yep. <laughs> we're going to finish up right here. Hot pan yet again. Zoodles go down. All right, so as Chef is finishing up the uh, healthy Ooh. shrimp scampi, don't forget nice. you can find this entire recipe online at uh, mysuncoast.com. Great work you're doing with Best of Success. Thank you so much. Thank you. We're going to follow all of the new programs that you have 
coming out. Yeah. And also, if you want to see Sarasota Contemporary there Dance, specifically see Charlotte Johnson, who performed earlier, that performance is on July 28th. Yeah, so you can yeah. find more information at sarasotacontemporarydance.org. Tracy, thank you so much for being here. Thank We've got our you. eyes out fun. for the Please new watch. Edible Sarasota magazine. We're going to dive into some zoodles. You take okay. some time. Enjoy the Suncoast views.